Megyn Kelly is smashing the fake news media, has more YouTube views than NBC, CBS, CNBC, and BBC combined. That is because people have a hunger for truth. People are, lie, are tired of being lied to by the mainstream media, the cover-ups. I mean, how many things I have to talk about to prove that the mainstream media has been lying to us, and they know it. Um, I could talk about COVID. Well, I can't really talk about COVID here, but you, I'm I just saying, I, I, my thoughts on COVID I have on Patreon, but I'm, I'm just saying I could talk about COVID. I could talk about the um, Hunter Biden laptop, Biden's, um, Biden's mental uh, um um, acuity diminishing. Um, I can go on and on and on about how many stories the mainstream media have lied to us about. You know, um, did I mention Hunter Biden? I'm not sure if I mentioned Hunter Biden. I mean, there's uh, literally lists of pages of things that the mainstream media has um, willingly lied to us about. Um, so no wonder that people are turned off from the mainstream media and looking at alternative um, news media sources um, like on YouTube, um, Citizen Journalists, people like Megyn Kelly, the Tucker Carlson's, the Joe Rogan's and, and things like that because they know at least, even though they, they do give their opinions on stuff, we know at least they're going to give us facts there. Um, so that's what we're going to be talking about today. We're going to talk about Megyn Kelly, but before we get started, go ahead and hit that like button, share this out so we can get this information out there. Subscribe if you're not already a subscriber and hit that alarm bell so you know when I'm putting out new stuff. Also check out my link tree in the description. It has a link to my Patreon. That's where I talk about things that I can't talk about here. Also follow me on, um, Instagram and, um, and, um, X link in the description for those. All right. So let's talk about this news. Now this comes from the Gateway Pundit's Ben Q, and he reports that former Fox News anchor Megyn Kelly is smashing the lying fake news media with her oponymous uh, podcast. Kelly, who launched the Megyn Kelly show back in 2020 following her departure from NBC News, is now drawing more views on her YouTube channel than NBC, CBS, CNBC, and BBC combined. Uh, Semaphore reports that when then host Megyn Kelly was pushed out of NBC News in 2019, many television network insiders thought her broadcast career was likely over. Instead, now Kelly is nearly as popular as ever. According to audience figures highlighted by Kelly's team for uh, Semaphore, Kelly's show uh, um, is now not only one of the most listened to programs on Sirius XM, but it's also one of the top 10 podcasts in the country. And its view, viewership is eclipsing that of some, some mainstream news outlets on YouTube. Kelly boasts that despite the fact that she only has six staffers, she has managed... Now, before I, before I tell you this, now, now notice like these networks like, um, like um, CNN and, and Fox News and MSNBC, they have... Hundreds and hundreds of staffers doing their bidding. She only has six, but she had um and and, and uh, mind you, they get millions upon millions of dollars for advertisement um to pay for all of this. But she has managed to get numbers that put in the range of the accounts of legacy media outlets. This is why you see a lot of people being fired and stuff like that with some of these mainstream outlets because they don't need all of this staff in the first place. But the Megyn Kelly Show YouTube channel, which has 2.3 million dollars, million dollars, <laughs> 2.3 million subscribers, had 116.8 million views in July. Wow, more views than the official channels uh, for NBC News with 78 million, uh, CBS News with 83 million, Sky News with 87 million, the BBC News with 72 million. And CNBC, 17 million. Quote, on camera is how people are used to getting their news from me. So it likely feels familiar, Kelly told the outlet. I am also half Italian, half Irish. So if you choose to watch the show, you will definitely glean something from the hand gestures and facial expressions that you might not always pick up on, on from listening alone. 
and she do have some funny facial expressions. With the news, uh, what it what it is these days, sometimes an eye roll, uh, forehead sl- uh, slap, or pen throw is absolutely required. While Kelly was once a contentious figure among the conservatives' grassroots because of her clashes with Donald Trump, I definitely remember those clashes, her popularity has soared in recent years as a result of her engaging interviews and criticisms of leftist ideology. Last month, Kelly made clear that she uh, would be supporting Donald Trump in 2020 in the 2024 presidential election and would, quote, walk over broken glass in order to vote for him. She said, quote, I've previously disclosed he will have my vote and I am now one of those people who will walk over broken glass to make sure I cast my vote, Kelly said following the failed assassination attempt against him last month. And now I know I won't be alone. Absolutely correct. And I'm one of those people that will walk walk um, through gra- a glass to make my vote as well. But y'all let me know what y'all think about this. Let me know what you think about the mainstream media being eclipsed by these uh, by these podcasters. Uh, leave your comments down below. Like, share, and subscribe. And check out jjthepsychotherapist.com for the latest in news. Until next time, peace.